now you can actually go ahead and install the program all right so depending on how fast your laptop is it should not take more than two to three minutes to actually complete the installation of the easy printer manager okay we're almost done here guys we're, we're taking you through each step so that you won't get lost when you're doing this at home or in your office all right we're almost there and yep okay come on let's go all right so when it's done hit finish and now you can go ahead and close the CD and see you will find a new icon on your start menu called the easy print manager if you don't find it you can actually go to all programs and scroll to the Samsung printers folder see there's a new folder there and you will also see the same program the easy printer manager go ahead and launch it this is a very important step because if you don't do this you will not be able to turn on your printers Wi-Fi direct feature so click on the advanced mode and you will find that uh, your printer is detected by your laptop and now go to where it says device settings go to the network tab and scroll to the left to the right rather let's maximize this so that you can scroll to the middle this is where you will find the Wi-Fi direct feature all right you see that on our machine it's already turned on because we've done this before but on your machine it will be on the off position so just turn it on and you here you can also uh, modify your printers name and IP address right now we'll leave it as it is but please make sure you know the password so the password we've set for this printer is uh, eight ones or one 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 so after you've changed the settings you can go ahead and hit the save button and if you see this change settings are saved to device successfully that means you're good to go and now you hit OK and we've successfully installed the easy printer manager thank you